Henry, how pleasing was that result today? That was good. It's, only, it's what we wanted. We want to build some wins going into the season. Obviously, a new team, um, completely new outfit, really. There's coaches involved as well. So it was it was good to get that result and keep pushing forward. It wasn't just about the result, it was, it was about the performance and it was a pretty complete one. Yeah, it was. I mean, the first half was a bit a bit loose. It was the first game for a lot of the boys. Um, it's always going to take a bit of time. So, I mean, there was that, that last pass, that last offload that wasn't really going to hand in the first half. But I think what we did do in the second half, especially as we react to that, we sort of nailed it down, got it a bit tighter and we, we got sort of results off the back of that. Was that a case of kind of over and Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. Usual? I mean, definitely. I mean, like, the set piece... Was, was really good in the, uh, all the way through the game, to be fair. And I think the backs um, got into the outside channel and we sort of we wanted to score straight away. But I mean, it's, it doesn't really happen that often now. So I mean, we, we wound it in a bit and we did the basics, used the forwards around the corner, sucked them in, and we scored in the corner in the second half. Do you have to look twice at times uh, yeah. today with that pack going forward so much? Well, pushover scrum, we said the pushover scrum was, was one we haven't seen in a while. So I mean, that's great. That's what we've. they've. Um, the, mem uh, the, the staff, sorry, have done a really good job. They've gone out and recruited the right people, and and, and, and there's results of it. Also, it's, it's it's not wasted really. So it's good to see from Bat's point of view as well. And how did it go for yourself personally, first game back? Um, a few cobwebs in the first half. Just getting back into it. You still get caught in the structures and stuff like that. But I mean, yeah, it was, it was good for me. I'm, I'm, I'm happy with the result to be to sort of contribute to that win um, at home, and now just sort of push through to the next week and make sure we keep improving as a team. Feeling good through pre-season though? Pre-season has been tough, yeah, it's been really tough and I think the boys have definitely reaping the benefits off there. We definitely look like a fitter team, we controlled the ball more through the whole 80 minutes really. Um, and I mean obviously like Laurie and all the other coaches, they're, they're really keen on making sure that we make our decisions and we control control the tempo and we did that and, and got the result. Last season was uh, kind of one we struggled with quite a few kind of niggly little injuries. I mean, you've passed all those now. Yeah, passed all those. Um, also had a good summer. Uh, coming back into pre-season was was good. So I've got a good few weeks under my belt, and and just as you said, just staying fit is the main thing, and and, and focusing on performance week in week out. And how optimistic are you about what lies ahead of this team? Um, I'd like to say I'm quietly confident. I mean, we're not going to go out and say we've. Um, with a complete team, we're going to be in the top four now. But I mean, we're definitely looking. To, everyone in this in this team, everyone in this competition wants to push for that top four. So I mean, be silly for me not to say I'll oh, give it a few years. But I mean, it's, it's it's definitely we're going in the right direction. Definitely. I mean, we we are putting together wins, even though it's only pre-season. It's good to get in those habits, and and I think we can learn something every week and, and keep becoming that team that on paper we look really good. And hopefully, if we can uh, fix those last like two on ones and those last passes, I mean, we take opportunities. We should be, we should be fine. I mean, for quite a few years now, everyone goes on about the Gloucester backline. Yeah. And, you know, again, it's looking even better with some of the new players coming in. Yeah, I mean, it's um, obviously last season was a bit tough, but um, everyone's still confident. Everyone's still got that belief in in the backline we've got, and now with the forwards that are looking looking awesome at the minute, they've been trained hard and they've been drilled hard, and and hopefully we can all come together as a 15 and the 23 and and, and do the job. And what about playing outside, James Hunt? Real good. I mean, he's he's a very um, he's a very elusive. He takes it to the line. He's got long limbs. He throws those big passes for me to get on the outside, and that's what what I want really as a 13. So, I mean, it's good. I think all the, all, all the backs are enjoying playing with him at the minute, as well as Ali that's come in as well. So yeah, it's good fun. It was a nice sort of combination, wasn't it, between James and Billy to put you away? Yeah. And that's and that's what the sort of preseason is all about. We want to build those partnerships. I mean, Billy said it in the week. Um, just drill it as much as we can. We just go through our moves that we know, and and yeah, when, when things come off that we've been practicing in training like that, it's it's always good. Do you expect um, things to step up at all against Scarlets, or is it a case of um, a few bodies up on the Cottonwood? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I mean, I'd, obviously, from my point of view, I'd, I'd love to play again. I want to sort of get an 80 minutes and keep rolling on to see. So I'm, I'm match fit. Um, I think that's the same for a lot of boys. Everyone's here to play. No one wants to take a back seat, and there's there's good competition in the squad. So I mean. Um, Something we've got definitely is is we've got sort of depth in our in our squad now, which maybe we haven't had the last few years. But I mean, it's it's, it's good to play. Everyone's getting some good time, and um, I'm sure the coaches will manage it well. It doesn't get much bigger than that first match against Northampton. Yeah, Northampton away. Obviously, it's a great game for us to see where we are straight away against the champions. And I mean, we're gonna we, we're gonna put everything towards it, make sure we play our own game, and just not go away from anything that we we haven't done in pre-season. Just back.